Hey guys, what is up? EBN Gaming back today with another episode of Extronus Factions on Extronus Factions. Wow, that was so bad. <laughs> I'd be in the description. Sorry I explained it that way, but guys, we are sitting here today doing some farming. I'm about to go enchant this bow to level 30. We're going to see what we get, and we are picking up some string and spider eyes because, guys, today we have been raided. So we are at a pretty awesome XP farm that Woody built with some spider spawners. Just getting some XP to go do some of this stuff. Very, very nice spawner farm. As you see, they're spawning incredibly fast. Like, five minutes AFK here, we'll give you 30 levels. So it is quite nice. So let's go ahead and go slash spawn. I will show you what I'm talking about in terms of getting raided, but we are actually going to go build a private vault today. It's just going to be me and Woody. If you don't know Woody, he's in a few of my other videos. He's my main recording partner on here, so we will be sharing a private vault because we got inside and not really sure who did it, but we built a base and there are neural holes in it, so I'm guessing inside it because you can't glitch in. It's a bedrock ground. That is actually a really good enchantment for that. All right, so let's run to the shop real fast and sell some of the string, buy some obsidian. We'll probably get about... Uh, five or six stacks. It's not that expensive over here, which is really nice. So, uh, we're gonna grab a few stacks of obsidian with some money from this. I can sell 16 string for 20, not too sh Excuse me, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. We can sell 16 string for 20 bucks, not too shabby. Obsidian is 750 a stack, or about $10 a piece. So, we can actually buy quite a bit of obsidian with all this. And, uh, spider is gonna take a long time to sell. Uh, I've been killing him with the looting three swords. You can see it's almost broken up. I've been using it a lot. It's a really, really nice farm, so it is quite nice. This should get us enough money for quite a few stacks of obsidian, and I can vote later, and that'll be $8,000 added to my account. Uh, let's see, we have rotten flesh we can sell. Where do we sell that at? Here it is. Extra hundred bucks from that. Uh, have, have some stuff, guy. Yeah, there you go. Uh, dinner, and yeah. All right, awesome. Yeah, so guys, we are saving up for a Blaze Spawner because Blaze Spawners sell for a lot of money. What do we have right now? We currently have $137,000, not too shabby, and we need 300 k or maybe a little less if we buy Auction for the Blaze Spawner. But that is not the point today. We are going to buy some Obsidian, probably... Uh, I want to make kind of a smaller vault so we can protect it better, so I'll go with six stacks for now. Let me show you guys what happens to the base at home. So I'll go slash home base. And... Uh, yeah, we got raided. Not really sure what this water's doing right here, but yeah, as you can see, really no visible holes in the surface. Both sides got blown up, so I'm not sure if we were incited by someone in here or not. But uh, you cannot glitch into the floor because at Y1, it is just straight bedrock, nothing above that. And uh, yeah, we basically got raided. But I was, I didn't like how this side looked anyway, so I don't even care, man. Yeah, uh, I think we managed to get most of the good stuff out of it because some of us were online while being raided. Uh, there, there's no poor raid control we never got to use. Hopefully, we'll get another one soon. And, uh, yeah, we're off to build a new base today, so I'm going to mine out of here, find a lovely place to build a base. Maybe we'll even build one, like, in the middle of the ocean and have it just protected by water on all sides and put a massive claim around. I actually need to do faction on claim all. Oh, maybe. Maybe do faction on claim all. Chroma. What fa- Oh, come on, man. All right. Faction on claim all all. This is so confusing how you do this. There we go. Alright, 50 chunks, let's go faction, faction. Oh, what, he's actually online right now. Maybe we'll call him in a bit and build a new base with him. It's like one in the morning room, what's he doing on? Alright, so as you can see, we have 65 power, so quite nice there. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna, gonna try to get Woody on here, and we will see if we can build ourselves a lovely new base. Alright guys, we are back, and this is not the overall as you can tell, we're actually in the nether right now with a potion of fire resistance, and this is my evil plan guys, we're going to build a base under the nether lava. And maybe if I get clever enough, I'll try to think where I like hide it in, hide the thing in the lava, but, oh please don't kill me. Awesome, alright, so guys, this is what we're going to do, we're going to build an obsidian base underneath this lava and hopefully if anyone breaks in the stuff will burn etc etc or they just won't see it we'll have a massive claim around it and we can also place chests in the lava to open from the base like uh, you might have seen Otekers he did kind of a design like that on uh, Arkham Network not Arkham the Archon he did it on the Archon PvP and uh, basically that'll pretty much make it unraidable if anyone raids it it'll burn the stuff so uh, let's find the bottom here and I think we will I like I like the lava part of my sprinting Let's find the bottom. Hopefully, it's uh, somewhere near. There it is. All right. Let's find the bottom. Let's build up a bit from that. We'll go that much up from the bottom, and basically, we are going to make 
a base under the lava and it should be pretty awesome if we can see anything while we do this this is going to be an interesting video uh, with me swimming around in lava most of the time so let's go one two three four five six lava pretty small for now seven eight nine ten. well eight by eight vaults so ten on each side two three four five six seven eight nine ten all right two three four five six seven eight nine this is slow going guys ten two please line up three four five six seven eight nine ten awesome now we gotta place the floor in yay Oh, I can't even see it. Oh, this is ridiculous. All right. Yeah, I think I might uh, do a speed build through this part, so I will see you guys at the end of that. All right, guys, we are finally back. Finally got this thing cleared out. Now I just need to place blocks in it to take out all the lava, and then I'll be able to mine these blocks out, and basically we will have our base. If you saw a random part of that speed will cut out, sorry, I'm a derp. I flashed my cords during it, so I can't really show that in the video, sorry. So, uh, yeah, that was the reason for the random cut in that. Hopefully I remember to edit that out, because, oh, dear. This space is actually looking kind of good, so, uh, yeah, that was an ordeal to build, guys. My eyes are kind of burning right now. <laughs> Alright, let's get... Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, I'm so happy to see darkness again. Oh, I'm gonna be on fire for a long time. Oh, thank you. Now this is all gonna flow in. Alright, let's see, you gotta block that out. Let's take out this wall. Oh, let's see if we can get it in real fast. Oh, no. It's starting to flow. Okay, there we go. Take this out, and then place blocks along here. And then take this out, and place blocks along here. Then we just mine that out and continue, and soon we'll have ourselves a lovely new base. So I really like how this base works, guys, because basically, uh, it's a lot more effective, I think, than a water base, because I believe lava get Oh, crap. <laughs> I believe lava... Gives you protection against explosions, and uh, it can't be cobble monstered because you can't place water in the nether. And basically, it seems like a pretty screw base because I mean, if you blast into it, blow open a chest, everything's gonna burn. And uh, basically, the, the stuff I just went through building this base has completely put me off ever raiding so many builds in lava ever again, or ever staying in lava for a long amount of time ever again. So uh, yeah, it should be just be like a really annoying thing to raid. Hopefully, it'll turn some people off of it. My fire resistance almost ran out while I was building that. I, I like barely caught it with a minute left. I was just like, oh, that would have been bad. Just lose all this stuff. All right, let that go down. Uh, I was going to build another portal, but I'm not allowed to enter nether portals. So, uh, yeah, that's interesting. All right, do that. Let's do, let's do it. Just one row at a time. N nice and slow. Nice and slow. Stop it, lava. The lava needs to flow slower is what needs to happen here. I think they actually slowed down lava flow on the surface. So usually in the nether, it like gushes out at you, but I think it actually moves uh, slow around here, which is both to like stop auto regenerating walls and all that stuff. So it is quite nice. 
Uh, yeah, there we go. So, I don't know if it's the last layer or not. I'm starting to run another act. I should have more of an inventory, though. Yes, I do. Awesome. Uh, I did not pull it up completely. Get that out of the way. Oh, I'm tired, guys. Sorry. Alright. Oh, there we go. I should have drank my speed potion. Whatever. Alright. Fill, fill, fill. Get it. Okay, okay. Got that. Got that. All good. Alright, let that disperse. Oh, so much lava in this episode. It's gonna be worth it, guys. Wor worth it, though, guys. No one, no one's ever gonna find this thing, right? Hopefully, I'll think it's on, like, the roof of the nether and dig up there, and then there'll be nothing, and it'll be like, ha, ha, get trolled. All right, there's two layers left. Let's just, let's just fill them all up at once. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Filling up that lava. That did not work too well at all. Oh, dear. Oh, dear me. All right, there, there's that. Yep, yep, yep. Awesome. All right, dig open the top now, and place these here. Starts this in a very exciting episode. Hopefully, we'll be back next episode with a raid or something, because they are a lot easier to find a server. We just need a place to keep all the stuff that we got out of our last base, and that we should be getting in raids in the future. All right, there we go. Yep. All right, and one more layer of our base done. We will claim it finally. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. If I'm wrong, Woody's not here with me. He was not able to join me. I guess he doesn't want to talk at one in the morning, which is a... Oh, crap. Which is a very desirable... I respect that decision to not talk at 1 a.m. in the morning. Uh, yeah, that's, that's a very wise decision, personally, I think. I would not talk at 1 in the morning, either. I, I usually don't talk at, like, noon. <laughs> oh, I've got a driving lesson at 8 tomorrow I'm going to wake up for, so that should be fun. All right, there we go. Fill that up, and... Finally, our base is done. Now watch me forget to set home. I'm not even kidding. I will forget to set home. Slash set home base. Make sure it works. Slash home base. Come on. You can do it. And it works. Awesome. All right. So now we just need to do faction claim one. You've got to be kidding me right now. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Broke now. Faction claim. Wait, what is this? Land claiming is disabled in World Nether. <laughs> I'm so done right now. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess we'll keep this as our house because, uh, I don't know if anyone will see it. That's really depressing though. Alright, so I guess we'll have an unclaimed vault under the nether lava. Uh,. Probably get raided by you guys soon, but you know, I'll I'll roll with it. Oh man, it's this same thing happened at the end. I tried to build out like a thousand blocks in the end. I got out there, land claiming is disabled in world at the end. I was just like, are you serious, man? All right, well, there's our base. I'm gonna have to resort to a new one soon, <laughs> but uh, yeah, there you go, guys. Here's our nether base, and uh, hopefully it doesn't get raided too quickly. And we can actually keep some stuff in it. And, uh, yeah. So thank you guys for watching this episode of External Factions. If you did enjoy, please drop a like on this video. It helps a lot. It makes my day. And if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe. But until next time, EBN Gaming out. Peace.